Well, let's say hello to a newest member of the MLB Network family, Xavier Scruggs. Let's Xavier, go. How you doing? Oh, come on, guys. Come on. That's, that's enough. That's enough. Uh, Xavier can normally be seen uh, 3 o'clock Eastern, Monday through Friday on Off Base. I, but watched, I watched the first it's good. one. It's good watch. It was good. It's well, a little Gardner. change up. Little change, yeah. little, talking about Spice. some different things. Yeah. Spicy. Oh, doing Byron Buxton's <laughs> outfits. Yep. We got to check out the swag. Absolutely. The guys are coming in looking good. I so. mean, when you talk swag, this is definitely. Is this the right group? This is definitely <laughs> the right group. We didn't even know what casual. That worked for two days. Right. Definitely. Robert that. showed up looking like All right, let, let's get into the top. <laughs> Outside. Yeah, my, my blue jean well, jacket I'll just broke point. the network. Oh, my Absolutely. goodness. Uh, why don't you do it for the, Johnny, man? <laughs> give us the, the top five things you're looking forward to here in the start of 2022. Yeah, I, talk, I, I saw you guys talking about a lot of good things. I had to do, go in my top five. You know, right, um, give it to us. First thing is the athleticism that we're going to see this year with the young guys. I look at a lot of the rookies are really coming on the scene. I mean, you talk Julio Rodriguez. You talk Bobby Witt Jr., uh, Pay, Jeremy Pena. I mean, if, if you remember, a lot of these guys now, they're replacing – some big name dudes. I think Jeremy Pena, especially, right? What did we talk about all offseason? Carlos Correa. How much is he going to get paid? Where is he going? Jeremy Pena steps in, steps in on the scene now, replacing Carlos Correa, a seven war win player, and now he's got a big, big shoes to fill. I look at guys like Julio Rodriguez. He's got the power, the speed combination. Bobby Witt. He's got to do big things for the Royals. They're coming up. This is a team that's really got to perform soon. Hunter Green, a guy, he looked nasty. Nasty. Did he look nasty? nasty. Against the World Series winning Braves? Yeah, just a I bunch mean, of tickets. That's what I'm saying. Like the athleticism. Plus miles per hour. I guess you're not nervous when you have that stuff. <laughs> But that's get out there. and that's one of the things is like the maturity of these guys, right? You think about how young they are, but they're still they understand the role that they have to play. They got a, they got big sh shoulders. And they've all it. been trumped in the early going by Steven Kwan. Hit yeah. the Kwan. <laughs> Hit the Kwan. <laughs> Hit the Kwan. <laughs> he doesn't even swing him. Hit this. the Kwan. All right, let me go with number four. Let all me right. go with number four. Um, I got the Giants, right? Can they do what they did last year? That's one of the things I'm looking for. The big thing for me is you lose Buster Posey. That's going to hurt that rotation, I think, a little bit. Not only defensively, but offensively. You think about Posey's numbers and what he did over the past few years. Um, but I still love the one-two, uh, Logan Webb. I love Rodon. Um, they have depth. We don't talk enough about Darren Ruff and his production, yep. as well as Brandon Belt. If they get that same offensive production, this is going to be a tough team to beat. And Brandon Crawford. The glove is nasty. Oh, nasty. Still <laughs> the glove so is good. nasty. Cobb I mean, was great last night. Alex tonight. Cobb in his Giants debut last yes. night. Ten strikeouts. And oh. I think just and five. And Longo's hurt. hurt. He's going to come back. Yeah. 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 And, and, okay, number three, Otani. What's the encore? Does he do better than last year? Can he do better than last year? From a pitching standpoint, I look at the velocity is going to be there, right? The split is going to be there. So for me, as long as he has his command, he's going to be on point. He can have the same numbers. Offensively, that's where um, it, can he do the same? Because if he has Trout and Rendon healthy all season, I think he can progress those numbers offensively moving forward as far as power goes. So I'm looking forward to see what Otani does this year for that encore season. Good uh, list so far. Good list what so you got far for number two. All right, number two. Um, remind, remind me with number two. Yes, Robbie Ray. There we go. Oh yeah. Who's, oh, yeah. yeah. who's this year? That. No, who's this year's Robbie Ray? Because remember, Robbie Ray busted on the scene last year, and we didn't realize he was going to be that good. Ooh, that's a good question. So for me, I look at guys like Jordan Montgomery, uh, Jesus Lazardo. He was nasty last oh, night. Nasty. 12 Ks. Um, I look at, uh, for me, I, I think it's going to be Dylan Cease, though. This guy's swing and hey, miss stuff. Nasty. Good one. 31% strikeout percentage um, last year. I think he's got the stuff, but also he's got the defense, too. The White Sox defense is solid. He's got some other guys in that rotation. And then number one for me, the number one thing I'm looking forward to this year, can Dave Roberts back up what he was talking about on the Dan he Patrick show? He did come show? out and say it. Can he back it up? He can did. he put his money where his mouth is? The, the thing is, I love the Dodgers, right? They have the roster to win. They have the roster to win the World Series. But I look at the other teams in the division as well as the other teams in the National League that got better. The Brewers got better. The Cardinals got better. In their own division, the Padres got a lot better. They created depth. And then I look at the Giants. They're still, they still won 107 games last year. Let's not forget about that. So I don't know if this year was the year to put your money where your mouth is and say you're going to win the World Series because the Braves got even better too. Braves got better. <laughs> Allegedly.
on paper, right? And, on paper. And you look at the Padres who get Mania going a little, you know, left yeah. starter, trying to think ahead. Hey, we beat the Dodgers. They got a lot of left-handed bats, so teams yes. are getting better. I really can't wait till we get to the thick of the schedule and those division rivals like the Giants playing the Dodgers, yes. and the Dodgers and the Padres. What that race is going can, to look like? Can I give you guys a bonus one real quick? Sure, absolutely. What you guys were talking about earlier, Albert Pujols, the Cardinals, I'm looking at a magical season, right? Wainwright, Pujols, Yachty, that last season, the last ride. all of them together. You, you guys know, you guys play this game. Something magical happens sometimes right. that you cannot explain. And with those three together, they can make some noise. You think now. Albert gets a 700 homers? He's I do. Wow. I do. Because, because of what you guys were talking about. You guys we were talking about the, but the adjustment. You guys talked about the adjustment. He's using the leg kick yeah. a little bit hot, standing a little bit taller now. I think he's going to recognize better pitches, especially from lefties. He kills lefties. He kills them.